Years ago, there were two good jobbers, men from the same culture, tribe, nation, living in, in the wild nature. So, what happened was the one wood chopper had a revelation moment, like he was like, "It's not okay, man, to cut down trees, to eat from the land, or like strike the kingdom, the animals, the birds, and take from the seas." So, he put down his weapons and he started a small farm, and nuts and seeds. And him and his family lived well, and they were well looked after. The other woodchopper, he kept on on his horrific, horrifying ways, chopping down trees, taking from the seas, eating live meat, striking at land, striking at the kingdom, that of the animals, nature and a queen. And one day there was a storm that arrived on the coast of Qatar. It was a thunderstorm, unfamiliar to the tribe of Chico, because the Chico tribe was used to hot, hot, hot weather, little rain, as the environment is almost like the Amazon. The climate is moist all the time. The thunderstorm entered. They came in from the seas, with a big wave announcing its arrival. Unfamiliar to thunder. Was the house that was built out of wood? What the smell of live meat? And as the thunder striked, it struck the house that was built by the woodpecker, and it put it to light, and it burned down away. The woodpecker that day. Was about to chop down one of the tallest greens in Hakachawi Forest. It didn't let lightning. She never did hit the tall green tree, nor the woodpecker. She hit the house. Never once. She striked. Never once. The winter thunder striked. It striked what was unfamiliar to her, the terrain, her territory, land. The woodpecker threw down his axes and his tools, as his family that day was at the river in Manso. Had they been in the house? Had he been in the house? They'd be no more. He had a revelation, knowledge like that, that he was looked after by one far greater. Than he could ever know. He took from the seas no more. He striked against the kingdom no more. Nature, tall greens, the animal kingdom, land, sea, land on earth. And the two woodpeckers started a small tribe call, and they call it Hakachiko. Hakachiko, which means life. Looked after life. We stand to it life. Akajiko. The tell story of the two woodpeckers. Life is a gift. Look after it. Keep on walking tall on your taller box. Tall.